my seat and go into that seat in that chair to the right. Oh. It's Detective Fields, right? Mm hmm. F yes. F I E L D S. Not sure if you're familiar with what we do, but our, our role is to investigate criminal activity by city employees, sheriff's office employees. Yeah. Um, I've got a case that's crossed our radar that came from some uh, news articles recently involving the gang unit, which I understand you're part of. Yes. Or yes. assigned to it. This yes. Is, yes. Okay. I guess, um, I guess technically I'm still part of the gang unit, just away on military. Okay. So I don't know if you had a chance to see this or have heard about it, but there's been some recent news articles involving the gang unit that have come out. Um, oh, yes, yes. Yeah, so these have, been, these have hit the news recently. Our main concern from the integrity side of it is mm -hmm. in the article there's some mention that the gang unit has been out there targeting people and violating their constitutional rights. Right. That's concerning to us. We want to make sure we look into that. So sure. That's, that's what this is about. Right. How long have you been in, uh, part of the gang unit, or, or do you remember uh, when you went there? Or roughly, I mean, it's a uh, Yeah, I want to say, I mean, I can't remember. Uh, maybe 16 or 17? Because we were still over at 7-Eleven. Uh, okay. Do you remember who all was in the gang unit when you first got there? I've got a list. Oh, here you go. Thank you. That may help. I may, I may have missed some, but if you could just check, put a little check mark by when okay, you worked so at, when I first came on? Yeah, or just to, oh. I just want to know who you worked with total. Like oh. if, if they're all oh. you worked with them, just put a check mark by it. If I, I've worked with them. Probably everybody with you. I yes, imagine. yes, because uh, me, and, me and Matt were like the one one of the originals. So you and Bowen were the first? Yeah. Okay. Because he, also he was before me, then when I came. Okay. Then um, a lot of these other ones came on. So it looked like it's all inclusive as far as? Uh, um, well, I don't know who Neater is. So okay. Okay. Also, I'm going to do one of these. Yeah, just check everybody you worked with before. Um, Kariga, Clem, Barry, Jordan, Williams, Smith. Chris Smith. That's the, one, that's the little black guy yep. there. Mm -hmm. right mm -hmm. that's, uh, Some of these guys may be new. I don't know if that's... Yeah, Craig, also me. Yeah. Yeah. me. <laughs> yeah. JJ, Wilford, Bowen, Medlock, uh, Cynthia, Ripley, Sullivan. Yeah. Is there anybody you can think of that's on the list that would have been detective wise that you worked with in there? No, I think it's okay. Um, I mean, there was a few SWAT guys, when, but when we were still over before it was organized as a gang unit, I think, right? Is that no, we were because no, because Robbie because Robbie had us over Robbie had us over at Seven uh, Eleven as a gang, as a gang unit. Okay. Um, so who, who what sergeants did you work for? Um. um Shoot. So the first one was. Um, Sorry. <laughs> no, I know. I know. I, I, when, when I'm away from. Right, right, right. So yeah, I, 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 um, or give me your last three or last two or three. Yeah, three well, I'm trying to. Well, the, uh, what, what's his face? He's out the academy now, uh, Sergeant. He's been on the SWAT team. Um, Batris? Yeah, yeah. Batris. Okay. Yeah, so Batris was the first, okay. then Robbie. Hanson. Yeah, Robbie Hanson's on okay. it. And um, Doug. And that's how. Yeah, no, okay. no. So I think yeah, it's, that's it's, the main source that have been there since it's kind of. And uh, you've been there since it sounded like organized. And yes. Bigger, bigger unit than this. Yeah, yeah, because when we were, I was part of the whole SWAT team slash right. gang, gang unit, then then Robbie came in. Okay. Um, so here's some questions that kind of go into what we just talked about a minute ago about yeah. the articles. So your time in the gang unit, have you ever witnessed, uh, participated in, or heard of any actions by any members of the gang unit that you felt uh, would have violated by his constitutional rights? No. Do you ever feel any time you were ever ordered, directed, or pressured to take any kind of enforcement action that you felt was unconstitutional? No. Okay. And then was there ever any kind of unwritten law or unwritten rule in the office that would have had you target or go after a particular group or individuals based on anything other than gang affiliation? No. Okay. All right. So that's the, that's the gist of what I wanted to ask yeah. you about there. Um, so in your opinion, there hasn't ever been any violation of rights that you've been part of or saw is what it boils down to. Yeah, no, no, okay. no. I think it's, it's, that's, yeah. that's all I need to come in. I appreciate you coming by for that. I was, <laughs> yeah. Like I said, every time we went out, it, I mean, I'll just add to this. It, yeah. we, it was strictly to, it was, there were gang members. We didn't go looking for anyone else because our mission was the gang that was the, that was, That's yeah. the mission of the gang unit, and, I mean. And, and, you know, it's sad to say, but, you know, the majority of the gang unit members, members of Jacksonville are, are minorities. So. Right. right. Okay. I'm not too worried about that part. I mean, yeah. I just want to make sure that the direction that we're going in was, y'all were targeting people that were, Related to gang members. That's yes. what, that was the goal. That's yes. what you did. Oh, yes. You've never seen it deviate from that from what you've no. seen. So I appreciate your time. Yep. Thanks so much.